You say you're the youngest of six. What was it like growing up in the house? Man, I got well. You know, I come from an older family. Older family. <laughs> Everybody know my dad had me when he was 61. So you get what? Sick. Yeah. My oldest brother right now, city sick. How? City sick. <laughs> my father said I got a grandbrother. What? <laughs> hold on. I Hold on. How you, you, I got a grand how you brother. got a brother hold on to be your daddy? Listen, man, I got great granddad. I got great niece. I'm a great uncle. I'm a great. I've been a great since I was 12. So he... <laughs> Listen. You got niece and nephews old as you, huh? Listen here. We had to change our relationship because they were, they were old. He was like, look, just start calling me your cousin. <laughs> he said, because I ain't calling you my uncle. I did. I'd be damned. we go somewhere. They'd be like, who did that? My little uncle. Hell no. Nah. <laughs> yeah, he's crazy here. <laughs> in school, what what was school like for you? School was fun. School was fun because I always was associated with people that 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 had like great humor. Right. And and it was some always about somebody that just had great humor. I was like, good, I could just you gonna make my time in school go by so much easier because right. we just gonna sit back and laugh. But having old parents, man, and. Not really. They wasn't all about that kiki kid, though. They weren't always about the kiki <laughs> kid, but when you know you're not really as fortunate as others, right. you don't really know because it's, it's the norm. Yeah, because so everybody else fake like, clothes, yeah. hand, hand me down clothes, not knowing, oh, bro, we really messed up in the hood. Yeah. You feel me? Yeah. My partner got on J's. I ain't got the J's. Right. I don't know when I'm going to get the J's, my right. boy. I'm just hoping and praying right. one day my people going to get me the J's, but guess what? I'm not faulting them for not having the J's. Right. I got on some Nikes. They might not be Al for one, right. but they Nikes, Nikes. though. But right. I know how to be clean with it. Right. So everybody who I was around I always accept my honesty. Right. I used to wear fake shoes and try to get my partner to wear fake shoes. I'd be like, why are you gonna spend a hundred when you can go spend a hundred and get two patties? <laughs> <laughs> they used to be like, look, fly, listen, oh, this, you a real one, but stop talking to me. <laughs> <laughs> Check this out. I, me, like when I was in school, I was I was a good athlete, but I talked right. with a lisp. And I made I made fun of other people so right. people wouldn't joke at me. Mm -hmm. They wouldn't look at the clothes that I got holes in my knees. <laughs> my pants was flooded, my right. shoes were messed up. Is that why you became No. Did you make fun? No. Nope. Did you play sports? You I played sports, yeah. What'd you play? Man, I played baseball, basketball, and football. I played slot, OG. If I seen you coming across and I would play a slide, but I get out of the way. Uh, exactly. I, I get all the way out of the way. Exactly. Oh, but I'm just letting you know I'm in the cut. I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm right there. Fly, but no. Fly, you weigh 140 right now. Listen, listen. And so at, at 17, you had to be like as, 123. As little as I am, I can take a hit. Yeah. And I know how to hit. Okay. So it was just, it was just a the power is there, it just don't look it. <laughs> no, it don't look it. It don't look it fly. But I'ma get low though. I'ma get low. I'ma get lower than you though. But no, it was a defense mechanism. Like I was just funny. And by my parents being old and by me not really just having the the, right. the, the latest fashion, it was like, well, let's see what we can get away with on him. Right. You can do that with me. Right. You you talk about these fake shoes, you better be ready. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? Cause it's like, who you talking to? Right. I want the one that's gonna be quiet. Right. So I would kind of like beat the person who was fresh. Right. I don't it don't matter if you was the fresh or you was the most popular. Right. I would make you see eye to eye level with me, boy. Right. And we and they gonna be like, oh little, little shout right there. He he he, he ain't you ain't gonna play see, with. you the type wasn't gonna let it go. You ain't gonna no. get one off, you gonna keep You wanna <laughs> fight, you oh oh, I don't know when to stop. I don't who, you who? Keep, you keep firing him. Don't say nothing to me. You're gonna get put in it. Just I let him get it, cause he shouldn't I'm gonna make sure he don't ever pick on me ever again. Right. So that was my I, I, I don't mind fighting on with that, but I was more of a ladies' man. Right. So if you're gonna talk about me or any of my partners, I'm right here. You know I'm finna roast you first period. Right. Second period. <laughs> oh, your mama just came up. Ooh, you got three hubcaps. You done let the wrong person see three hubcaps. Right. Oh, no, I'm on you the whole season. You getting the guys that laughing too? Because you know, normally it's the guy that, okay. See, this the thing. If you green, you in. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Because that, that's what make you mad. Somebody laughing. Oh, he said that. Why you, you ain't mad at him? He, he you, you I, So that means you thought it was funny. That right. means you thought about it too. Oh, no, you green, you in. Listen, we used to roll so bad, people used to be like, because <laughs> they knew that was the rule. If you green, you in. But that, all that B100 was our way of showing love too at the end of the day. That right. was comedy. Right. Me not even knowing that God was training me on the way. Like, I got voted class clown in the 12th grade and didn't even know that them folk put my name on the ballot. No, no, no. This is how my peers looked right. at me as a damn clown. Did, 
<laughs> at no point in time when you was growing up did you ever think, you know what? I can make money doing this. I can be a comedian. Hell no. Hell no. Telling jokes. At one point in time, being funny was a, song, a form of way of you being friendly or you scared. Right. You feel what I'm saying? You, you, be you trying to be everybody's friend yep. and you trying to make everybody laugh. Like, That's why if you was my friend, you knew I was funny. Right. Because I'm, I'm really standoffish. I ain't finna be opening my mouth like that because you know the, the loudest mouth get hit in the mouth. Right. You feel what I'm saying? And you know back then when you talking out of turn, right. you need to be ready to, 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 to back that shit up. Right. One no talking out of turn back in the day. Right. So I had to learn that. So it was like, nah, hell nah. You, you was my friend and you knew I was funny. But it was like, God was showing me, listen, you already used to this right. since you was a jit. Right. Even if you're not even knowing that this is what you're supposed to do. You was working on your craft and didn't even know it. Didn't even know it. I was being like, I was literally doing, I'll never forget one time I got kicked out of school, right? A dude had- Only one time? This the only time I got caught. <laughs> this was, yeah, you know, I was, I was a smooth criminal, baby. I know how to talk my way out of any and every. I'm like, you gonna kick me out? You gonna kick, look at me. What I really do? You can't kick this face out. <laughs> man, then, man, he said something about my mama so bad. No, he said something about my dad. Cause everybody knew my daddy was old. I'll never forget this shit. This shit, this shit hurt me to this day. I was in 10th grade, chemistry class. Miss Taylor. That nigga said, but John, I know you ain't talking, but that's why I heard your dad almost died last week. <laughs> I'm talking about the whole class went crazy. So I, I'll never forget his mama had some big ass, can I say titties? Sure. Big ass titty. I'm talking about huge. I'm talking about stupid. So I grabbed two chairs. I said, I know you ain't talking about that. Why your mama titty this big? Grab two chairs, put them to my chest, and walked around the whole class. <laughs> nigga, I had the whole class <laughs> hollering. Nigga, the teacher was like, Whitfield, sit down. I was like, you don't know what he said about my daddy, girl. Shut up. <laughs> nigga, I'm talking about, nigga, I, I felt it. I, 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 she gave me a fifth eight. I, I had to take her class again the next season. <laughs> I sat my head down that time. <laughs> you know what to do. Hit the subscribe button and become an official member of Club Shay Shay, where we do something before two something.